It is currently a game o'clock, as they say. We are playing a gun game in Fistful of Frags. Uh, this game is a very, very unique way about it, and it makes me very angry very fast. But I'm gonna try and keep my cool. That's the challenge. Playing this game. Oh my god, how did I hit that shot? Okay. Okay, see that right there? I pulled my trigger first, personally, so I probably should have killed him, but... Uh, game says what the game says. That's the final decision. No arguing with it, but that's okay. Anyway. It's no matter. Uh, we're doing pretty good right now. Having some fun. I need somebody to kill, because this gun is not good for mobility. Ah, hello. I did not scope in fast enough. That is okay. There we are. Alrighty. Wow. Quick promotions here. Right, let's get this. Let's get a kill with the Spencer. Hopefully. Hello. Yeah, the Spencer is not my weapon of choice, personally, but, you know, there we go. There we go. Coach gun. Uh, we need to get a quick kill with this thing fast. Hello. Alright, I need to get rid of this gun rig right now. I need to be two levels up, like, five seconds ago. Hey! Damn. I mean, that was fair. He was gonna get it in the first place. I could not reload fast enough. We are way behind, though. We need to get... We need to get uh, some progress going. There we go. Drink some whiskey. This is my favorite gun right here. I love this gun. I don't know why. It's my favorite, though. Come on. Get over here, you yellow belly. There we go. Ooh, that was the fastest I've ever gotten rid of the, the mirror's leg there. Don't forget, kicks are always a reliable source of damage. There we go. Don't turn to me. Um, <coughs> pardon me, friend. Pardon me, friend. I need to get rid of this gun. There we go. Hey. Ah. There we go. Holy crap. Oh, finally. He he's probably been waiting to get off that thing for a while. I am catching up though. Get him, come on. Yes. See, this the if the real strat is if you like desperately want to win is to go only solely for headshots, don't do body shots, but I find that that gets kind of sweaty after a bit so you just kind of play and then when you play there we go kind of just end up having fun um we are quickly uh making up for oh he got the point blink shot those are always hard for me when i try them uh while uh, while i'm gaming here let me go ahead and tell you a little bit about this game this is fistful of frags i've played this previously on the channel here but uh I don't know. I've kind of felt nostalgic recently. Uh, just checking it out. I recently just reinstalled it because uh, I was notified that it got a update, the horse riding update or the mounted update or whatever. I could not get behind that corner in time. But uh, yeah, uh, you can ride horses in the game now, so that's pretty cool. You can trample people with them and all that. It's pretty cool. Oh, oh, that was satisfying. Anyway. So I decided to come back. I YouTubed it to see what was the hustle was all about. To my surprise, um, I, or not to my surprise, I can't say that. Uh, to my just kind of a hit of nostalgia, uh, I saw Jerma's video because Jerma made a video on this a while back, uh, like five years back, and like a few other people have made a, a video about this recently, but uh, not a lot have. Uh, so, uh, yeah, it was on YouTube, saw Jerma, and I was like, I'll give it a, give it a play, might as well play some. I, I did get some, uh, kind of, like, up on this footage where I was just kind of gaming, um, enjoying the game, enjoying the flow. 
there we go. So uh, anyway, on the on the topic of Germa, um, I can I can I can't stay on the topic of Germa. We're gonna use Germa as a segue to talk about TF2 for a bit, because I just saw that they put a blog post on the TF2 website. And that's big. That hasn't happened for I don't know how long. I have I don't think I've been in the community long enough to know. I I have been in the community for quite a while. But anyway, so it's big. This is big big news. Um, and I'm surprised. Oh. Whoa. Okay. So note to self, it's nigh impossible to shoot from the train. Anyway, uh, big news. Uh, it was a, basically a call of action to all workshop creators to get making. Uh, they're going to do like an actual summer update this year instead of it just being like a cosmetics, you know, case drop and stuff. They're actually working on an update. And that has just got me all sorts of excited. Um, I did give up basically on having a TF2 update for a while because it just seems so impossible. Everybody was constantly talking about how hard it would be to, or how impossible it would be for TF2 to update because the team didn't care anymore. But very clearly, somebody does care. Somebody has been pushing the button to you know, release all of the those tiny content updates that we got with the cases and the stuff. Somebody was pushing the button for that, and I mean, that's just just me. I am. I'm probably still too young in the community to uh, say that, but I do have a lot of hope. Hope is something I have, especially for TF2, my favorite game. Um, you know what? You know what? I'm gonna put a spell on this. We're gonna we're gonna hop over the TF2 just to just to sham wow you for funny. Uh, hold on, give me one second. I'll be right back. Anyway, uh, we are back. It is uh, TF2 talk time. Can you believe that? A double feature. That's so cool. That works so much better than I thought it would. I have stalled for too long. We gotta get back to talking about the matter at hand here. TF2 update in summer. Uh, summer of 2023. Which, I don't, I'm thinking maybe that's like a March thing. I don't remember exactly when summer is like slated to start. But it, se it sounds to me like a little bit of a March thing. So that's kind of what I'm going to presume. And we are getting spawn camped. Anyway, I am super stoked. Uh, I don't know. There's they, They've not really committed to a particular theme at current, I will add. Um, there is no, like, expressed uh, kind of theming for the update. I am thoroughly excited. Uh, I have always... I mean, I never really said anything because... A lot of the community still has a pretty sore spot about the lack of updates, but I've always pretty much hoped, or at least had a inkling, shadow of a doubt, that TF2 would be updated again. If if not, you know, regularly, one more time at least, before they do a final send-off, which I'm hoping that this isn't what it is, but it does kind of feel like that's the direction that they're going with this, which is quite, quite sad in itself, but I'm not going to look to give horse in the mouth. If we get an update then we get an update. I keep I keep kind of wandering off topic. TF2 update. I don't think I've heard uh, words that could amount to that or that mean the same thing. Have the same connotations as that particular phrase right there. We are getting rolled completely. Woof. Hurts a little bit, but it's okay. Um, the last time we got an update, I was so hyped. Like, the, seeing the dread, the, what was it, the thermal thruster on Pyro, that was epic. The SFM work was always just absolutely amazing from Valve. I don't think we're getting, like, a full short from Valve, at least not, like, a Valve animated one. Um, actually, if I'm gonna be honest, we can make this, like, a little wishlist video of what I'd like to see. I would honestly be super, like, super hype if we could see, like, um, a winglet animate the you know like a trailer for the new update or something that would be awesome and i i mean i i, I probably shouldn't be like just forcing a workload onto somebody apologies there um but uh that'd be super cool to see let me hold on i'll be right back as i uh, change uh, change games here i'll be right back
TF2, TF still, still, still kind of gets me there. It kind of, I love TF2 so much. I really hope that push that we that we just absolutely forced through their line wasn't because of a bot there. This game means quite a lot to me, and to see that we aren't, we haven't been abandoned. Like, I mean, I can't really say that because that that sounds like that sounds kind of weird, but. It's less abandoned and more of the, 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 there is still interest in support and continuing support of the game. That seems kind of suspicious. Yeah, that is kind of suspicious. That might be... maybe not. I don't know. Yeah, this is unfortunately the last game. That's fine, though. We had, we had a good time of it, I will say. That was definitely one of the better games I've played today. It's the only game I've actually played today, aside from the other one you saw. But anyway, I think I'm going to stop jibber-jabbering there. Uh, because if I continue, I'm going to talk for too long. And then no one will enjoy my content going to say thank you for watching um uh, i'm gonna put a link in the description to the uh tf2 blog post so you can read it for yourself because it is some some freaking sports movie stuff uh hopelessness but it's okay because there's actually hope oh my god so give it a read um check out fistful of frags which is the game i was playing earlier great game it's free on steam if you haven't already, I don't even know why you're here. If you haven't, check out TF2, Team Fortress 2, on Steam, which is also free. If you decide that you enjoy my content, uh, go ahead and push the like button. I will give you a bottle of whiskey, uh, fistful of frag style, and I will give you a sandwich TF2 style. You guys have a wonderful day. I'm going to let, let you guys go. I have been your pal Starch. And I will see you next time. Bye-bye.